What's up, what's up guys? Here's the part three video that I had told you I was gonna do. Um, at the end, you're gonna see me turn it on, but for now, you're gonna see me here putting the, the accessories on on the truck. Um, you know, you have, to, you have to put the power steering pump, the uh, alternator, all that stuff back on that, that you know a regular VA truck would have on the, you will need the the power steering lines and power steering pump to a V8 truck. But other than that, everything else will work. Um, as you can tell here in the lighting though, this, this didn't happen in one minute. We were there a couple, you know, probably, I'd say probably about an hour, hour and a half. And then we decided to pick it up and put the flywheel bolts on. And at this time, we realized that this flywheel was not going to work with the torque converter that the, that the customer had bought. Unfortunately, um, we did decide to put it on the lift, which you will see here in a little bit. There you go. And uh, right here, we we also decided to go ahead and do headers on it as well, which you, which you will see here in, in just a couple seconds. Yeah, there you go. Well, <coughs> another thing. A side note, as you would say, or side story. So uh, right here, you're gonna see my dad holding the light a lot. Now, a lot of you guys probably just like me had to hold the light for your dad when you were a kid, and you remember getting hit with a wrench or the back of the hand or something. You so you got hit with something because you weren't holding the light right. But my dad right here, as you can tell, a lot of the time the lights on the floor. He's not shining in the right spot and uh and we argued a little bit about that and we made jokes about it how he couldn't hold the light but he used to tell me all kinds of stuff when i was a kid you know but you know he helps me i can't complain all right so here in the right there as you can if, if you could you know i don't know if you were able to tell i put the transmission jack right there uh, we did separate the transmission and get the flywheel out and put the new one in. And right there, I'm adjusting the torque wrench to the specs I need to torque it to. The the torque converter, not the torque converter, the uh, flywheel, I torque it down to 65 foot-pounds. That's what I torque it to. Yeah, right there, you see us get the headers. At this point, like I'm already done with... The flywheel um, and I was just good uh, right now you'll see me put the starter on now guys when you see these videos if you have any questions you know feel free to ask me um, any questions that you may have and I will I will gladly answer them you see you see the there's the starter hanging there you go so now I got it in there and we put the headers on which they were eBay headers <coughs> that the customer got and they were they were a pain to get in there but they got in there right here you're gonna see me put you switch out the radiator now on the Silverados there's two radiators there's a narrow one and a wide one if you're gonna use a fan shroud and um, you know fan clutch I would suggest using a narrow one because they're easier to find everywhere if you use a wide one then I would suggest you use electric fans they're a lot easier to find um, <coughs> right here you see me put you know all the stuff on the fan shroud the uh, upper radiator hose lower radiator hose um, you know I right there I'm putting the uh, AC lines on and condenser <coughs> right now I'm putting the the colder intake which I'm real anal about getting everything square so that's why I'm taking a little bit longer on that but I'll get it to the point where I can actually turn okay, it on guys, so here it is all done from V6 to V8 everything looks like factory we did do headers and colder intake now I haven't tried to start it yet but I already did the vats delete off the computer so let's see if it fires up.
there you guys have it v6 to v8 swap well thanks for watching guys and part four with tuning coming soon please hit the like button and subscribe for more videos